Hey y'all, Renee here, Funky Butterfly. You are not going to believe how easy it is to paint jewelry with DIY paint. Let's play. So this side, so you can see what it looks like. I didn't do anything to it. I painted this super fast. It's not done. So I'm gonna show you how to add a little bit of green wax to this that will seal it. Um, it is very similar to the one that I did. So I have it on tonight. And this one is sealed with wax, y'all, with DIY wax. I painted it. So similar, that's what we're gonna do tonight. Isn't that so cute? Y'all, so fast. Let me show you. The one thing that I definitely wanna do on here is add, oh, the green wax. Come on, <laughs> it's the shipwrecked green wax. You all know how much I love this wax. My first video posted on here, I'm showing how you can layer it with the other waxes, and this over Blue Iris and Salty Kiss is so magical. Now what I'm doing, I'm literally just using my finger, you guys, and putting it on a necklace, or a bracelet right here that I did real fast, but we're gonna do the other side, so don't worry about it. I'm gonna show you how I did this, but I wanna get a little bit of this setting in, and then I'm gonna just wipe it back real fast, and then I will let it set. I'm not rubbing real hard. I don't want it all, but I don't want it on the top. I want it more down in the grooves to give that really cool, aged, fun, patina look. Now look, let me show you. But wait, there's more. <laughs> Flip it over. Watch this, you guys. All this was, I'm gonna make sure I'm referencing it. I'm gonna take my larger paintbrush, old 57. I went right across the top, right? Do not think about it. Number one thing that I teach when I'm painting is don't think about it, it's just paint. You can go right back over it, you can correct it, or you can even just wipe it off. It's that easy, right? All right, so I'm gonna show you. Old 57, bam, it's on there. Okay, then Salty Kiss. You know those are my favorite colors. Gonna go right back on top. I'm skimming the top of my paint. Now I'm just gonna go on, make sure this is right in the camera. Gonna go right in and I'm gonna layer that on. Sporadically, I'm not pushing down too hard because what I'm trying to do, you guys, is you're staying on top of the paint. So I'm not blending, I'm staying on top, okay? So I love orange. Come on, y'all. It's one of my favorite colors. So then I went in, and there is just tiny, tiny hints and pop of color in here. So then I just went in like this with the orange, very sporadically, lightly. Tap, tap it on there. The other color I love, orange and pink. So Fire Starter with Kissin Booth is the most magical beautiful color combination. I do have some of those in the bracelet that I'm wearing. Now, I'm sure you can see what the final step is, and even though it's a bit early in the process, let me show you. To me, what always makes my jewelry done is the patinas. And so Golden Ticket is my poison on this one. I love me the copper, but the gold with the green and the blue, and I just take my little artist tool here, and I just come on there like that, and then we do need to let all of this dry, and then I will add the gold wax. You guys, I swear, what was that, five minutes? Five minutes, how fun, how funky. I will wear this thing everywhere, because it's got my favorite colors in it. Okay, so once it dries, DIY paint dries lighter. Now, I didn't use my technique of adding all the waxes. I just did shipwrecked. I only used the green wax, and so I'll do the same on the back side, all right? So now we're gonna let this fun little thing just sit here. It's gonna make friends with my necklace here. They would make a really cool, you know, like I said, you can gift things together. What a fun present that would be. However, that stays in my jewelry collection. <laughs> so the first thing we're gonna do, and I don't stay on very long, y'all, but I wanna get at least two of these flowers done with some layers, okay? Now the other ones, I'm just gonna show you, even if you just have two DIY paint colors, like those earrings there, one other extra step you can do to make them look even funkier. But even just doing that, they look beautiful. 
All right, so I'm just gonna wipe that on my little handy dandy paper towel that I have right here, and I'm gonna go in with Kissing Booth. And then I'm gonna just start layering up these. Now, you could just do this, and already I would have a necklace that I would probably wear more because it has color in it, and it's interesting, and it's fun. So now I have colors in here, and I just went around and layered Salty Kiss on the tips because I love to layer up colors. You know what else is my favorite color? Orange. I tend to wear a lot of orange. So I'm going to go right in. I'm going to hold this up so you guys can see. And now very lightly on those petals, I'm just going to do a dab with a little skinny paintbrush, nothing fancy, orange. Whoop, whoop, there you go. Look at that. Cute. Now remember, DIY paint dries lighter. I will seal this with Big Top. You can do wax. I did wax on the bracelet that I painted. It has held up beautifully. Right now, let's let that little funky flower there dry. Y'all know I love me my flower. Okay, y'all, here comes the earrings. You are not going to believe how easy these are. I know it looks like I spent a lot of time, but now you're going to see I really didn't. It started with two simple colors, Fire Starter and Kissing Booth. Let's do a little bit on this one. So just adding another dimension, another layer. So if you just have to order two colors and then do a liquid uh, patina, which is also a top coat. I love me some golden ticket, y'all. Golden ticket. <laughs> See, right? Super easy. All right, let's flip this over. I'm gonna just take my finger and I am just gonna go around quick and easy, super fast. If anything, I love to show people how fun, how easy, and for those who say, oh, I can't do that, yes, you can. Yes, yes, you can. I'm taking my finger and I'm just rubbing some paint on there and giving this an extra little bit of dimension, an extra bit of funkiness. Now, oh, maybe that's probably too much, a little bit less than that. Fire starter is the orange. The orange, which is fire starter, and the hot pink, which is kissing booth, oh. So now, I just upcycled a plain, boring pair of earrings into some with my most favorite colors on it in two seconds. Y'all, that's how fast. That is how fast, that is how easy, right? Go in that junk drawer. Go find those pieces of jewelry that you don't wear. You're going to start having a love affair with your jewelry again. So how many people are digging in your jewelry right now? Go paint some, y'all. All right, everybody. That's my time. I want you to have a wonderful evening. Stay funky, everybody. I love you all. Bye.